ओके मैडम इफ यू कुड गिव मनी I will give what happened take later you have 3 months of due left and currently i need to what happen if 3 months have gone are we running somewhere or are we leaving this society and you haven't got such a big bill uh, no no ma'am it's not like that winters have come and I have to borrow warm clothes for kids it would be great if you could pay now okay don't hurt my head get the money next month now leave Yeah. He was asking for money. Give him. You should pay him every month. They have also expenses. They also need money. You stay quiet. It's my job. I know when and whom to give money. I'll handle myself. Still, Ria, he was asking, what's the problem in giving money? And what's the amount of their bill? Fifteen hundred, two thousand would have given. Oh, but they don't have expenses also, na? All money is saved. What's their cost? They just have to do iron. You're doing it wrong. You don't teach me what's right and what's wrong. Mind your own business. I'll see myself. Hi, madam. Yes, say. If you give money, yeah, you are so shameless. I told you to take the money collected next month. You have come again. Oh, uh, madam, I am extremely need money. My kids go to school without sweater in the morning. They may get sick. I have to buy sweater for them. I have never come to ask you for money for the last three months. I request you that give me money. Wait, let me get you money. Here's your money. Everything is cleared. What's this, madam? This is only two thousand rupees. Your bill is of five thousand rupees. Oh, and the shirt that you had burnt? Who will give money for that? You had burnt that shirt and didn't even told. Shirt? Which shirt, madam? This one shirt. It was worth three thousand rupees. I have deducted money for that. This shirt? I never did iron this shirt, madam. How can I burn it? Okay. Am I lying then? Have I burned this shirt? See, don't argue with me unnecessarily. If you'll keep talking to me like this, I will stop giving work to you, and will ask all my neighbor friends. I'll ask all of them to not give work to you. You burn clothes. No, no, madam, don't do this. Okay, get out from here, madam. <laughs> Ria, what have you done? What? You know very well that you burned this shirt, not him. Then why did you deduct his money? Hey, you didn't see? He was repeatedly asking for money. Would we have ran away with his money? Are we thief? What wrong did he do if he was asking for money? He did work, so he will ask for money. It doesn't take five hundred rupees in a bill of five thousand rupees. They earn a lot. Ria, it takes time to do work. There is nothing expensive than that. How much does they work? They do it whole day. You shouldn't have done that. You have done very wrong. See, see, no need to angry on me for that presser. I know what's right and what's wrong. What happened? You went for shopping. How did you come empty-handed? My purse was stolen. Purse was stolen? Where? How? I don't know. When I left home, I had purse in my bag only. When I did shopping and went for payment, and so there's no purse in the bag. Remember something? Where did it fell? Who stole it? I don't remember. He took my one month salary in just a minute. Got it now? How does it feel when the earnings of our hard work got out of our hands? Think, how must that man have felt when you deducted his money? Yes, you are saying right. I shouldn't have done it with him, and maybe it has happened with me because of this to make me realize my mistake. It has not happened to you. It has been done. Means? Means that I took your purse when you left the bag here, so that you understand that you have done so bad with him. I've understood. 
Let me give him the rest money. I'll never treat anyone like this. I promise. Brother. Madam. This is your leftover money. And you didn't burn that shirt. It got burned by me. And from now I'll never deduct your money. And if you need advance, let me know. I'll give you advance also. Okay, madam. Thanks a lot, madam, for money. Take care of your kids and buy some nice sweaters for them. Okay, ma'am. <laughs>